Gidish. Hello and welcome to Good God. I am God, and today's episode is brought to you by beavers. Beavers, they got tails that slap the water, they can chew trees down, they're awesome. I made them. Check them out. Here on the show today, running for president of the United States right now, Dr. Ben Carson. He's a neurosurgeon. Hello, Dr. Carson. How are you today? Hello. It's good to be here with you. It's not every day that I get to talk to somebody on my show who's running for president. I think America needs what I can offer, given my background as a neurosurgeon. I've spent years taking other humans, Mm -hmm. opening up their heads, and getting a look at exactly who they are. Okay, it's a little weird. And now that I know who Americans are, I, I feel that I can lead them better than anybody. Just because you've looked inside their... I've, I've looked at their brains, God, and I know that Sh- I can open up their minds. And I want to do that to everyone here in America. I want to change who we are. Are you saying that you want to cut into every American's head and look at their brains? That's exactly what I'm talking about, God. That is insane. I want to open up the head of every American. And right now, I don't have the powers to do that. Okay, that's... Only the president has the power to do that. And so, as soon as I become president, on day one, what I'm going to do is repeal Obamacare. Okay. Make our border secure. All right, yeah. And I'm going to start opening the heads of every American and getting inside. Side. You see, right there is where things go really wrong. You can't do that. Not even, you know, the president doesn't even have the power to do that, you know? He I'm pretty d- sure the president has the power to do that. He doesn't, though. He doesn't, though, Dr. Carson. Okay, you were a neurosurgeon. That's great. But being president is more about trying to get laws passed. You got to make speeches. You got to shake a lot of hands. And- I'm happy to do all that if that's what it takes to get what I need. What you need? I like touching the brain. And I like probing into their brain. You know, Ben, you shouldn't be saying this on my show right now. There's, there's, someone's going to make an attack ad about this. The American people know I will go inside their heads oh, and I will touch their brain. They don't know that you plan on going inside their head if you're elected and, and checking out their brains. I mean, what are you going to get out of going in and touching their brains? I get a lot out of it. Oh, man. It felt like... You're talking about sexual pleasure. You're not talking about that. I try to put my my penis Whoa, as close as I can no. to the brain. No, Ben, don't start talking I about your penis. I try to put my penis as close as I can to the brain. This is not right. So that I can really feel who, who they are. So you're going to hump somebody's head while it's open with the brain. Humping is such a crude word. You know, in this context, I feel like you're saying smart words crudely, so it doesn't really matter what kind of word we're using. a good track record of leaving behind a little bit of me inside people's heads. Oh, my God. And closing it up. You come on people's brains and then you close them up? I come on people's brains and then I put the skull back together. Oh, jeez, Ben. You just blew your presidency right there, pal. I'm telling you, I'm not. You think so? I don't need re-election. If I can get everything done that I need to in my first term. Well, you know, I got the feeling that you wouldn't get reelected if, you know, you start doing everything that you're talking about. I think when you're president, you can do whatever you want. So that's all the time we have for the show. I'd like to thank my guest, uh, Dr. Ben Carson, for being on the show with me and revealing a truly horrifying side of himself. Uh, Once again, today's show is brought to you by beavers. Beavers, they're little mammals. They chop down trees. I love them. Check them out. I've been real close to some beavers before. Man, you messed up a beaver. Don't forget to vote for me. Ben, you suck, man. Got out!